Hey guys, how's it going? Uh, sorry about not making a video in a week, but in this video I'm actually going to be addressing that. You probably are wondering the same thing that I am. Where is the iOS 4.2.1 untethered jailbreak? And I'm going to go to the iPhone dev team right now and just be explaining a little bit more about that. Um, as you can see, their last post was five days ago up here. This is about the unlock, and for some weird reason... Um, they're talking about the iOS 4.2 unlock before they actually have an untethered jailbreak, which I just find strange. But I'm not going to be going through that. I'll go through that in a later video after the jailbreak is released. However, the link to this website will be in the description, and you can check it out if you really want to. Um, and you want to follow through with that before actually having an untethered jailbreak. I've been sitting around here for a week, just as you guys have also, thinking that the jailbreak was going to be released last Sunday. Hopefully it is released this Sunday or tomorrow, December 5th. But for right now, we're going to have to wait and see um, what they release. As you can see in this post, I already talked about it in my previous video. But now they have released Red Snow version 0.96b4, um, which will also be on this website in the description. And basically... What this program allows you to do is jailbreak your device on iOS 4.2.1 tethered. However, if you are on an iPhone 3G, iPhone 3GS, or a uh, iPod Touch 2G, it already is untethered, so you don't need to worry about it. But most of us are on the more modern devices, and it will be tethered. Now, tethered, if you guys are still wondering what tethered means, means that you cannot install any tweaks like Springboard um, or Com Center on your device or Cydia with, without um, actually rebooting every time you turn it off. So if basically what I mean by that is if you have one of those in, installed and your device shuts down, you won't be able to start it up again unless you hook it up to a computer, which is really annoying. And as you can see on the website here, they say, remember Comex and others are working on a way to untether the 4.2.1 jailbreak. Um, hopefully these above three points, which I just went through, will make it all seem less um, confusing. So I find it kind of annoying that the iPhone dev team is only saying that um, that it is untethered now. This is how you do it untethered. Um, and we should have an untethered, I mean this is how you do it tethered, and we should have an untethered jailbreak coming uh, on, people are saying tomorrow, Sunday, like I said before. Hopefully that is actually true. Um, if you guys want to follow through on the guide on the untethered jailbreak, go ahead and download one of these links. But again, this video was just me basically ranting about why um, I'm pissed off that they're, they haven't released the jailbreak um, untethered yet. Um, but again, the link will be in the description for the unlock for the t uh, tethered jailbreak. And if you guys want to go ahead and check that out, go ahead. Um, please follow me on Twitter if you aren't already so I can actually update you when the real jailbreak comes out as well as to visit my website guys. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. Please rate a thumbs up and subscribe and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.